Hello. Hello, my name is Gary Liker, the creator of Sumner Skies Planetarium. I'd like to take you just for a quick tour. This is being recorded in July of 2015. Uh, the planetarium has been around since the 90s when I operated a nine-foot dome, and now, for about the last five years, I've had a 15-foot dome. It's attached to a large old barn uh, with some other things in here, so let me just take you around. Welcome. I'm sitting in the Senior Citizen Lounge. You may notice Whistler's mother up there. I spend more and more of my time right here. Of course, this planetarium is mainly for kids, sometimes called the Gallatin Children's Planetarium. This is my work area. To build a planetarium, you employ pinhole projection. You can buy, I'll do another video on that, you can buy numerous different toy planetariums, all of which have value. Um, I'm the founder also of the Home Planetarium Association, a very loose group that builds planetariums and we do feature several home built planetariums as well as some older commercial models. This is the barn proper. We do have a small observatory. It's still under construction. I'll take you out here just briefly. It's just building this. It's going to be an observing deck with telescopes and got a nice view of the nighttime sky out here. But as you see no telescope yet. So under construction, hopefully in years to come, on clear nights at least, we'll be able to come out here. There's a map of the galaxy. We do talk quite a bit about stars here. We love stars. There's a refrigerator, cold drinks. Here's one of my telescopes, still on the floor. Hopefully that'll be in operation. Here's a hard to find early Renoir Cosmorama in pieces. Here, this section I call affectionately the Sumner Star Theater. I am just finishing up filming my Khufu video, which you can see on the website. And there's Khufu. He lives in the pyramid. And I reenact and sometimes sing this actual show if you come see this planetarium. We even have a fog machine. Look at that. We have a beer can collection. We have glowing skulls. Anyway, this is the Sumner Star Theater. There's the barn, second story. But we do all kinds of crazy things in here, or at least I plan to. Now let's go into the planetarium itself. This is sort of my visitor center. I've got some rather odd things on the walls in here. These are the stars, is my inspirational 10 minute show. Um, Taylor Swift hasn't been here, but she does ask you if you have star power. And I just like stars, okay, like this guy here. And just say stars, as the pianist would say. So once you get past these guards, by the way, James Bond himself wants you to bond with the stars. Secret agent, man. All right, we're going into the tunnel, into the planetarium. It's not unlike a coal mine. It's going to be a little dark in here, but this is the 15-foot dome. You can see that. It's plastic. It's been several different things over the years. This is about the fourth configuration of this star theater. I'm using the Steve Smith copper cylinder, which is drilled with over 2,000 star holes. I've got other planetariums. We've got simulated crickets. Maybe you can hear them. Here's all my control panels. I've got the world's largest con uh, um, collection of extension cords. We've got just limited seating. There's about six or seven people come in here at a time. The shows are brief. I make sure you view the show in comfort. Got nice rocking chairs, padded chairs. We talk about the Dippers and their role in navigation, the Southern Cross. I've got a backstory on lighthouses and ships at sea. I even got a little laser show, which I shine lasers through all these crystals. And sometimes I play live music, which is over here. Even got a back room 
That one's allowed back here, but I'll do it just for this video. Sometimes I sit and smoke my pipe back here. That's when my wife thinks I'm the weirdest. But anyway, this is Sumner Skies Planetarium. We've got mountains on the walls, lighthouses, stars. The stars are very realistic. Oh yes, we have a small miniature village down here. And I think you'll, your breath will literally be taken away when you come see me. So come hear a few songs, hear a few poems perhaps, but basically would love to see you here. Um, this is just some of my other mementos, baseball collection, hockey, I like all the sports. So anyway, we return once again to Whistler's Mother. Maybe I'll light up a pipe or some old commercial planetariums. My book of poems by Tennyson.